I got that new drip, shoot a pop out with the pool stick. F and then Draco and Stinny 30, hit and sell my hill. For the brand new rolling wrist, bust up my wrist, I flex like WrestleMania. I just might go take a jet to Australia. You pull up on some rep, I know that I'm texting. I hop on Bugatti, push it to the max. Soldier had the biggest comeback of 2019. I don't wanna hear it, man. If you're not saying Big Soldier had the biggest comeback of 2019, you geeked right now, man. Drake. Arby Graham in the wheelchair. Drake. Yeah. Y'all niggas better stop playing with me. <laughs> Alright, y'all. So what is going on, man? This is Caleb coming to you guys with another banger video, man. I'm so excited to make this video because a lot of people have requested it. So here it is. So today's video will be another installment of basically my fire outfits in my collection slash sneakers, I guess. So I'll be running down some of my favorite outfits that I've worn in the past that you guys really want me to go over. And I'll pretty much tell you where I got all my pieces, how much they cost, etc, etc. And you guys can rate them down in the comments down below. So pretty much before we get into this, man, I do want to say thank you guys for all the constant support on my new picture, man. I almost got like 6,000 likes in one day. I think it's like 5.2K likes in one day. Well, it hasn't even been a full day yet, man. So I do want to say thank you guys so much. And if you haven't followed me on my Instagram, make sure you do so, man. It will be right here or right here, man. Y'all know the vibe. One more announcement to make that I am gonna have a new intro I'm not sure if it's gonna be in this video or not, but I did get a new intro also also I have purchased a new camera So the camera that I'm using right now is the g7x mark 2. I did get a new camera I cannot wait to use it. I hopefully you guys do enjoy that man I got a camera, you know, what I'm saying a lens hood ND filter I got all that type of stuff that goes with a premium vlogging setup man. So my video should be top-notch, you know, what I'm saying a one so starting off with the first outfit, let's not start with the one that I just posted, man. This was the outfit that I posted on my Instagram. All right, so pretty much running down this outfit up top, I did wear this Montreal Canada number 90. Now you guys see it does have the shotgun distressing, you know what I'm saying? Some people like it, some people don't. To each his own, man. But yes, it is the Montreal number 90. Y'all see that right there with the same holes in the back. It's a dope tee. I think I pulled it off good. So yeah, that's the t-shirt. For the jacket, I wore this North Face camouflage jacket. Now this retail for about 225 on North Face. So if you guys want to cop that, you can, man. This is a camouflage North Face jacket. Probably one of the dopest North Face jackets that I've ever worn, man. I really do love this jacket. So yeah, this is a camouflage North Face jacket. Now, a lot of people ask me why I did get my jeans. Now, these jeans are very similar to the Undercover 85s in the black colorway. These are actually my bro. You know what I'm saying? It's Father Don. These are the Empty Spaces one of one. He actually has another version of these dropping. So if you guys do want to follow his Instagram, it will be right here, man. It's Father Don. Go spam him up, man. That's my guy. But yeah, man, these are the car. Carnage denim. Now he gave me these a while back, a while, while back, and actually this is before they actually dropped. So I guess you can kind of call these one of one type samples. One of my favorite jeans, bro. These are so fire. As you guys can see, man, I think I pulled them off pretty good. So yeah, man, again, it's Father Don. Go spam him up, man. He does a great job with needling, scabbing, all that type of stuff, man. So again, it's Father Don. Go spam them up. And lastly, for the shoe that I wore with this outfit. Now, there was a lot of confusion on this, too. These are the classic green Air Jordan 4s, man. I told you guys about these shoes in my last video, but I guess you guys didn't watch that video. These are the classic green Jordan 4s, man. These dropped in 2002. No, 2004, I believe. And you know what I'm saying? I actually have a really good pair, man, because these are yellowing, obviously. But it's not that much yellowing. And it's not any detachment of the sole. You know what I'm saying? You do have your slight cracking of the sole a little bit. But, you know what I'm saying? This is a very good shoe. I think I pulled off pretty good. Make sure you guys rate this outfit through 10, you know what I'm saying, down in the comment section below. But yeah, that's the first outfit. So yeah, man, let's get to the next fit. So the next fit that I do want to talk about is this fit right here, man. Now, as you guys can see, I call this the Spaghetti Boys slash Meet the Guys fit, man. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. So the shoe that I wore is obviously my favorite shoe, one of my favorite shoes of all time, man. The all-white Coca Enos, man, the all white Air Force Ones, man. Now, these are actually kind of beat, but I still do wear them because, you know what I'm saying, you can make beat forces look good. Rather what you think or not, I feel like you can't make beat forces look good, man. So, yeah. Now, for the bottoms, I did go with the Meet the Guys jeans. Now, everybody was asking me, yo, Cash, where'd you get those jeans from? How'd you get to the website? Yo, these are the Meet the Guys jeans. Now, these are extra, extra long. You guys see these, man. These are extra long because they do, you know what I'm saying, incorporate the stacks. It makes premium stacks. So, again, shout out to Zay. Shout out to everybody at the Meet the Guys team, man. You guys make some dope jeans. And yeah, these are actually one of my favorite jeans, even though I've only worn them one time. I consider these like V Loan alternatives because you guys know the V Loan jeans have nice stacking to them. So I call these the V Loan alternatives, man. Now, they did take pretty long to come in, but you know what I'm saying? Honestly, it was worth it. I feel like it is worth it. So yeah, man, these are pretty unique jeans. You don't see everybody wearing these every single day, man. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, Meet the Guys jeans. You know what I'm saying? You can go up on their Instagram, 
purchase from there or go on their website, you know what I'm saying, meettheguys.com. And yeah, man, that's that. On to the next piece. So the next piece that I was wearing, it's obviously the Spaghetti Boys hoodie, man. Now again, shout out to Kerwin, shout out to Ass Pizza, all them, man. They put together a very dope hoodie, and that's why I'm wearing it right now. This is the Spaghetti Boys, you know what I'm saying, turn that ish off. I don't want to say it because I don't want to get demonetized. But y'all get it, man. Very dope graphic. Y'all see that right there. Pretty much has this big dude crushing this dude because his music is lame. Speaker, you know what I'm saying? Y'all get it. So again, man, shout out to Spaghetti Boys, man. Dope hoodie. Now let's get into the last outfit, man. This was definitely my favorite. So this was the last fit now. This is actually my favorite fit. You know what I'm saying this was actually featured on Grill's app and their Instagram page So again shout out to girl for the follow and all the support man But this is the outfit right here now a lot of people have mixed opinions about this outfit If you know what I was wearing, you know that this is a dope outfit man I don't care what nobody says man. I pulled this outfit off together perfectly especially in my opinion You know what I'm saying so we're gonna start from the bottom up You know what I'm saying so I don't really feel like getting them But obviously I was wearing Air Force ones in this picture it's not that hard to tell. So the jeans that I was wearing, Autumn Winter 2002 Comme des Garçons, you know what I'm saying, home pants. And these are absolutely fire. These are the Cuba denims, you know what I'm saying. Definitely fire jeans. You don't see everybody wearing these, bro. Like, definitely one of my favorite pants, bro. I feel like I pulled this fit off together so perfectly. It is a very hard pant to match with. I'm not going to lie. Like, it doesn't match with a lot of stuff. But once you find it, you know what I'm saying, that tee or that, you know what I'm saying, hoodie, sweater, whatever, it looks super, super good, man. So, again, one of my favorite jeans if you are actually interested in getting these though make sure you hit my dm on instagram man the life of cash k and yeah man that's that let's move up so next up on the pieces man i was wearing this rav simmons i love you sweater now people are trying to say this wasn't rav yo if you actually know rav this is actually a rav sweater people say it's the broke version of the i love ny sweater i don't care what you say man this is still rap i still liked it you know what i'm saying it still goes perfectly with my fit so you can say what you want man but i think it's a very dope piece so i actually did sell this piece Piece. That's the reason why I'm not physically holding it right now but yeah, man, that's the Rap Simmons I Love You piece, which was also purchased off grilled. So if you guys want to eat Rap Simmons number nine, you know what I'm saying, undercover, any of those type of pieces, man, you can get them down at grilled, you know what I'm saying? Just make sure you do not get banned like me. But yeah, man, that's that. That is the last fit. This is my favorite fit, man. Again, shout out to Grub for posting a kid, man. Hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, make sure you give it a big thumbs up, man. I also have so many more videos, you know what I'm saying? Bro, I'm trying to tell you, 2019's our year, bro. I'm not even trying to joke, man. I'm not trying to be funny or anything. Think 2019 is really our year and if you don't believe me just watch man but with that being said man cash family the latest biggest family on youtube and if you didn't know now you know man i love you guys peace